operating in private, a private company information. National Center for State Courts. And the reason that I know about this in part is because of, so let's just listen to this real quickly. Um, no, the very line is we're not directly employed by the courts in them. No, they're, con they're contractual employees and I would say for the last two or three years, I think if you look, they have been returning about 60% of their contract costs. In other words, we charge for their services, so we return about 60% of their costs. But again, this is based on it's, uh, it's time to give employees a raise. They're contract employees, but you built in a raise. There's an ongoing effort at state track uh, each individual court's expenditures for the reports that they have to do for, uh, for the state. Uh, I, I might add, I did attend a court's administrator meeting on behalf of the judges some month or six weeks ago, and there's, a, there's an ongoing effort at state court administration because they... There you go, at state court administration. Of course, that's Miss Nicket crap and, you know take aborted fetuses, use their identities, whatever you want to do. It's just a good old dirty world of government, right? So here's where they trade, where they make money on this private company. Some Bloomberg report. That was effective, let's see, 10-6 of 2015. Here's some papers that either Chris, Denny, or Patrick, one of them sent them to me on this. I had found this about the state administrative courts and found that picture, but I hadn't gotten into actually finding these. So this is, as you can see, National Center for State Courts, private company information. Miss Mary Campbell McQueen, Chief Executive Officer, 111 2nd Street Northeast, Washington, D.C., 20002, United States, right? National Circuit Gary W. Lynch of Missouri Court of Appeals, Southern District, has been selected to serve on the National Center for State Courts Board of Directors for a three-year term. Judge Lynch is immediate past president of the Council of Chief Judges of the State Courts of Appeal. He was appointed to the Missouri Court of Appeals in 2006. Previously, Lynch served a three-year term as Associate Circuit Judge of Polk County and the 30th Judicial Circuit. And here's uh, Mary McQueen, 10 Relationships, Chief Executive Officer, President, Next Officio Member. Myron Steele, Chairman of the Board, National Center for State Courts. Stephen Holland, Vice Chairman, National Center for, for State Courts. Roxanne Conlon, National Center for State Courts. Rosalind Frierson, Esquire. National Center for State Courts, Christine Durham, National Center for State Courts, Richard Godfrey. Let's see what that, I like it. When it let's see what that's about. Okay, I see. Member of Board of Directors, he's with Kirkland and Ellis LLP. Theodore Olson is with Gibson, Dunn, and Crutcher LLP. Eric Washington is with the National Center for State Courts. Pamela Harris is with the National Center for the State Courts. And Gary Lynch is with the National Center for State Courts. Mary Campbell McQueen. Myron Steele. Mary Campbell McQueen. Stephen Holland. Roxanne Barton Conlon. Rosalind Woodson Frierson. That's a little bit different of a name, isn't it? 